Even more if you can. We're getting so much on the ground. One, two, three. Oh my gosh, look at that. Bring that diffuser back, Lynette. Hi guys, my name is Jason Lanier. We're here at Balboa Park. Um, we've just finished a shoot, and uh, this is what's the end result of the shoot. <laughs> but I wanted to mention that uh, this is going to be an awesome shoot using the 100mm STF with the A7 II. We're going to show you guys how it all unfolds. This uh, video is sponsored by Squarespace. I've used Squarespace for the last three years, uh, and just recently, as in two weeks ago, we've taken them on as a sponsor. And I've used them for my JasonLanier.com website. They're easy to use. They're easy to set up. They're, they're very user friendly. You can set it up, it's plug and play, drop your pictures, write your stuff, do your blog, everything right there on your website. And I absolutely love working with them. So if you go to www.squarespace.com slash Lanier, you can get 10% off your first order. And if you just go to Squarespace, you can enter the promo code Lanier and get 10% off your first order as well. You guys have seen me shooting a lot with the A7R2. And one request that you guys have had is for me to shoot with the A7 II because there's a lot of Sony users out there with the A7 II. So what we're going to do is show you guys how this lens performs with the A7 II um, and really show you guys some cool stuff. Now, as you can see, it's raining. It's pretty, uh, it's been stormy all day. Every time I've tried to film something for this 100 millimeter STF, um, we've had uh, storms come up. So we're just going to make the best of it and go from there. We have some beautiful models with us today. Come over here, sister. This is the beautiful androgynous god, uh, Jazz, the model. Yeah. We're filming this with the DJI Osmo. Which is really cool. Which is really cool. It follows you. It's like a little it's stalker. Like a little ball. Yeah, that's one way to put it. I'm going to capture some raindrops in the back of the shot. And the key to capturing raindrops is you have to, you have to illuminate the water from behind. So I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about here. You're going to see this car come up, and then you're going to see the raindrops actually start to fall. So the headlights of the car are going to illuminate the raindrops. You guys see that? Just like that. So when you want to illuminate something, you just flip it around. See right there? When you want to illuminate water, you have to backlight it, just like you see right there on the car. So we're going to go over here, and I'm going to show you guys what we have set up. We're setting up the Anova Pro. We're going to diffuse some of it with this Westcott illuminator here. Okay? And then we've set up my Flashpoint Explorer. It was set up over here, but they moved it. Hey guys, bring the Flashpoint back over here. We're going to set up the Flashpoint Explorer right here, and it's going to back illuminate the model. A really beautiful area here down in Balboa Park. Really going to make some beautiful shots. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, it's been a really wet, wet very stormy day. And uh, sometimes when you get a crew together and you're going to shoot, you have to make the best of it. And that's what you do in real life. You know, if you're filming and or it's, it's a wedding day and you have to shoot, well, this is what you do. You just make the best of it. So we're going to do that and uh, share it with you. Let's go. Let's see. Bring this closer. Right, so see, that's without the flash. And that's that's without, with the flash. Without, without it. So what do we, we turn that one down? We tilt it that way. That way. We tilt it that way. So that. Yeah. So guys, this is kind of cool. What I'm doing is I'll show you guys some of the stuff that I'm, I'm teaching Brenda photography, and I'll show you guys kind of some of the lessons that I teach her. So we're getting some back. We're getting some light. We're just test shooting right now, but we're getting some. That flash is hitting the side of her face and it looks as beautiful as she is. That flash is not as flattering as it could be. So what we need to do, do you want to wear a coat while we get things ready? You good? Yes, that's what I thought. Okay. Despite all of the jokes we make and stuff here at Jason Learn Photography, we, very, we care very much about our models. You see, we're not getting much of the raindrop. I'm trying to see if I can put the light on the table. Oh, I think so. Slide in. 
There you go, beautiful, right there. Oh. <laughs> That's really awesome. All right, take that thing off. I'm trying to decide if I like the red or I don't like the red. You feel me? The red of the umbrella over there. It's cool, but... I think so. Okay, and make it bring happen. the umbrella down. Okay. You're my man, Q. You are my man. One. Oh, yeah, look at that. Mm-hmm. Just blocking it. Bring the Nova over here. Let me not speak too you don't, you don't feel the rain? Let me not speak too did, did you say you don't feel the rain? I feel it now. Are you, ready? It. Are you ready to feel it? Did you say you don't feel the rain? Did you really say that? Yeah. Did you really say that? I did. Because you know where you're going, right? You know what's happening? You said you didn't feel the rain, honey. You got to feel it. Okay. Yeah, go back. No, no, no. There you go. Yep, yep, yep. Keep going. Right there. I'm well, about to test the waterproofness on this lens and this camera. So you're gonna take your hand and kind of pull down on this and look up like that. Practice it for me. Now you're gonna do it with this hand. All right, turn this way because you're gonna be facing that way. There you go. And then bring your left shoulder around to me. There you go. You don't feel it, remember? All right, I'm gonna make a homemade um, rain poncho for my camera. You ready? Aww. All right, so I'm gonna cover this guy as much as I can now. Why? Well, A, that's not my lens. B, I do have the uh, most importantly really here is I'm worried about the, uh, the trigger more than anything. It's not really the camera as much I've shot with the Sony cameras a lot in the rain. It's mostly the trigger I'm worried about. Again, whenever we've had issues with um, rain and gear, it's not the lenses and bodies we're messing up. It's the, it's the triggers and like the mic receivers. That's the stuff we end up ruining. So there we need to tie it. Yeah, that's fine, like that. <laughs> okay. There you go. There you go. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Hips this way. There you go. Pull on your hair. <laughs> you go just like that. Go about five, five rows, three rows back and go right behind her. Right there. And point it up. You want me to do that low? Yeah, but point it way up. There you go. Even more if you can. We're getting so much on the ground. One, two, three. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Wow. Uh, right to me. Wow. Jazz, you're going to love these. <laughs> She's like, I better. <laughs> Take your hand up, hold it up like this, just like that. Put on top of your head, Go like this. There you go, like that. One, two, three. Tilt that head down, just like that. One, two, three. Uh, let's have you come out this way. Those shots, Jazz, seriously. 
<laughs> See what, what I mean? They look crazy. Come over here, honey. The only problem now is we don't have the Anova. That's the only problem. Let me see if it's worth it and then we'll mess around with it. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. We need to find a way to bring the Innova out here without getting it drenched. I know you're cold, but you, you saw what we're creating here. Now, guys at home, this will void your warranty. Why am I doing it? Well, I really want the shot. I'm going to do everything I can to protect it. I'm not trying to treat it lightly. I'm going to drop these two first barn doors. It's not going to matter. There's more than enough light. The main part on any electrical device you want to protect is the part between the battery and the, the thing. If a, if a if the device is going to fail you, it's usually going to be the link between the battery and the, the device. So you got to look for the open parts of it. So. Let's take this out now. For the kitties at home, what I've done is I'm using the lights that are hitting this, the back church here. I'm using the lights that are just cast by, or the lights are coming up from the roof. They're shining onto the back of that facade, that building right there. And then I'm using the Innova Pro to illuminate her. We're using the Flashpoint Explorer 600 to backlight the, the rain. And then we're using the um, diffuser cover to cover over the Innova Pro with a diffuser in front to soften the light. Okay, I'm shooting at a very, at a higher ISO so I can expose for that backlighted building. <laughs> wow. Take your uh, left hand and pull onto the lace of the boot and bring that knee in. Go like that, there you go. Oh yeah, that's fantastic. Now pull on this with that so it's more tight. There you go, fantastic. One, yes, two. Q, you may have to go down a little bit. Okay, that, yeah, and point it way up, Q. Bring that diffuser back, Lynette. Take your uh, left hand, hold on to your hair. Hips the other way. There you go. Spread your feet out. There you go. Pull your hair towards your body, just like that. There you go. Scrunch up your arms a little bit, just like that. Look, bring that right shoulder down just a tad. There you go. One, two, three. We need to hold the light down, but then we need to cut the bottom part of the light. It's called flagging it. We need to flag the bottom part of the light, which means we, we put the light towards us, but then we get like a piece of cardboard or something and literally cut part of it off. Let me see. This might work too. Brent, this might work too. Jazz, you're a trooper, honey. Thank you. I know you're freezing. I love you. Just keep asking myself we don't, why we don't shoot more often. We're coming back. <laughs> Perfect. Come on over here, Jazz. Before you leave, get my number. Okay. <laughs> you have my permission to harass me. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> well, I already did. <laughs> One, two, three.
Really testing the bokeh on this now. And it is perfectly round. Ice to me. Guys, come over here with the light. Come over here with the light. Go right behind her. And pop it behind her. Correct. Just like that. One. Good grief, that's amazing. One, two, three. We got it. Great job. You are amazing. Seriously amazing. You are amazing. You did a great job. Thank you for being such a trooper. Tell all these uh, all these awesome people at home where they can find you. Jazz the model on Instagram and on YouTube as well, Jazz the model. Anyways, Jazz did a wonderful job. Thank you. You're welcome. It was a pleasure to work with you. You did a wonderful job. Well, thank you. <laughs> We're going to work together again. Mm -hmm. Thank you to uh, Brenda for assisting. Thank you to uh, Jason for filming. Thank you to uh, Timoteus and my man Q for helping out like they always do. And Q's been on many shoots and is an awesome friend. And the beautiful Lynette for, for assisting. I apologize. She was a trooper and held the light. Um, and uh, again, we shot this with Rotolite, we shot the Flash One Explorer. I did this one with A7 II for you guys with a 100 millimeter STF lens. Shot out in the rain for over an hour and the camera's still chugging along. The camera's pretty wet, guys. The lens is very wet. So if you're wondering if it's waterproof and all that, it's very wet. I put the trash can thing over it really because of the transmitter. So, I mean, the camera's very wet as you can see. And I'm only pointing this out because there's so many times that people ask about Sony's being able to shoot out in the rain. Um, it's still working, still firing, still doing what it needs to do. Go to uh, www.squarespace.com slash Lanier to get 10% off your order, your first order with Squarespace. Did you have a Did you have a good time? I had a great time. Yeah? Are you <laughs> yeah. freezing? I am. <laughs> yeah? Um, is there anything you wanted to tell the folks at home? Thanks for watching. <laughs> so until next time, keep shooting, never give up on your dreams. Brendita, ven aquí por favor. This is little Brenda. She's all she's all uh, warmed cold. up. I'm still cold. This is a shout out to our friend Jeff Ray. Every time, you know, Brenda Popsicle Brenda loves the song Popsicle no, Toast that you played for her. She I actually has a picture of you, and next to it she has hashtag Popsicle Toast. <laughs> do not. She actually will get a, she'll start to shake her hips, thinking popsicle toes, and she thinks of you, Jeff, all the time. But I don't, Jeff, and I don't, Norma. <laughs> I don't think Norma's too worried. But <laughs> but but uh, Brenda goes like this when she gets cold. It's really cute. She literally goes like this. She puts a little smile on her face and she freezes like a little marching ant. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, keep shooting, never give up on your dreams. Friend our together works for you. And remember, you only have one chance to get it right. You only have one chance to get it right. I'll talk <laughs> to you guys later. Bye. Bye. All right, guys, let's go. Let's get to uh, shoot with Cassandra now. You guys still here? Hello? Talking to you. Hey, guys, if you want to learn online with me, go to patreon.com slash Photography, and you will be able to continue this craziness online from anywhere on planet earth with me if you want to join me live go to jasonlanier.com workshops and you'll get to see me in my full glory live and in person guys i think there's a smudge on there yeah i got it talk to you later guys bye